Rising petrol prices are being blamed for a drop in tourism in parks. Occupancy rates for this long weekend are the lowest in years and hotel owners are feeling the pinch. There's plenty of room at this inn and at most of the other motels in parks. It's the quietest June long weekend locals can remember. For the last 10 years at least, uh, Parks has been booked out for the June long weekend. We have a myriad of events taking place for the June long weekend and that's seen the town full, so it really is quite unique this year. Vaughan Bridgman has been running this hotel on the busy Newell Highway for five years. But in the last six months, he's seen a big downturn in customers. Across the board, we're down about 20% in turnover and uh, people are really watching what they're spending and, and they're not travelling along the roads. Just two of the town's 13 motels are fully booked. The caravan park and the pubs are half empty. It's hurting everyone, especially in the accommodation areas and, uh, and in also retail. After taking a battering from the horse flu epidemic, which forced the park show to be cancelled, the local tourism industry must now battle escalating fuel prices and interest rates. Travel and entertainment seems to be the first thing to go when the purse strings are tight and I, I think that this effect has um, come through to the June long weekend as well. The park's picnic races would normally draw huge crowds on the long weekend. Organisers hope a late flood of racegoers will boost the numbers. Hopefully people will change their mind and decide to still come at the last minute even if it's just for a day trip. Melinda Farrell in Parks Prime News.